While the action on Mauna Loa can be seen from almost anywhere on the island most nights when it's clear, that hasn't been the case for other eruptions, yet access has almost always been given for people to see them. New at 9, I spoke with the Hawaii Volcanoes National Park to see how they make it happen. Whether it's watching red-hot lava from Pu'u'o'o pouring into the ocean or seeing the bubbling magma from the summit eruption at Halema'uma'u Crater, people have flocked to Hawaii Island to witness the power of Pele for decades. People really want to see active volcanism. Hawaii Volcanoes National Park has helped get people as close to the action as quickly as possible. When we can, we will provide safe, active, safe access to um, lava flows and to the volcanoes. And they do it any way they can, by setting up viewing areas like this one at Kamokuna in 2017. The Park Service was able to, you know, make a kind of a, a makeshift trail, if you will, 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 over the hardened lava flows with reflectors and rope lines to keep people um, at a safe distance. When Halema'uma'u erupted last year, they created a makeshift viewing area, which is still there today. It's the only place you can see both Kilauea and Mauna Loa erupting simultaneously. Something Farrakhan says hasn't happened since 1984. But she says sometimes it isn't safe to provide access because volcanoes are dangerous after all, which is why the slopes and summit of Mauna Loa are currently closed. And those hazards could be the volcanic gas being emitted, definitely the case right now. Um, it could be Pele's hair, those glass particulates being ejected out of the volcano or tephra, or just the nature of the lava itself. Due to the location and spectacle caused by Mauna Loa's eruption along Daniel Keinoe Highway, officials moved quickly to provide a safe vantage point. It was a, a collaboration and partnership between our state, our uh, partners at uh, PTA, Puakalo Training Area, and uh, just a, a desire to make something happen to protect people who are driving, to protect our public, and you know, just really it was a safety issue. Ross says the safety route will remain open unless it becomes unsafe. Now, visitors are welcome to tour Hawaii Volcanoes National Park to see both volcanoes erupting in tandem. And happening tomorrow, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park is holding its annual Holidays in Kuhuku event from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. at the park's Kuhuku unit. There will be hula, music, food, and Hawaiian crafts. For more information, visit k 12com